Hello and welcome back to the vlog. This is my first international travel video and so I thought I'd take you with me on a journey of Dubai, strengthening friendships and insights into my general day-to-day -day stupidity. Here's a very selfishly indulgent video of all of the above. We start on a definite low point as I miss my actual flight to Dubai, but I do end up finally making it there and meeting up with Sheen who's kindly hosting me for the next two weeks. Our first activity together is taking a pottery class, a very random but very entertaining experience. I found my dexterity skills do not extend to clay and once I had a wonky bowl made, we headed to the beach. Um, it's horrifying because I know this part goes well and then I end up just messing yeah. up. You're very good at this. Much, much better than me. Surprisingly, you're the artist. Let's not say that here. <laughs> the world has no hope. We spent most nights walking in and near the sea, sipping ice kark, definitely one of my favourite drinks of all time. The days always end with delirious laughs and some movies in the background of work. See, now you're ready for me to come in. <laughs> okay. So you almost filmed me while I was being. I was waiting, I was being respectful. I was literally, I had my finger on the thing, being like, do I turn this on or people are going to hear this in the background? Hear me being. There was a lot of pressure to be honest. Okay, so we have decided we are going to do face masks tonight, mostly because my skin needs all the help it can get. So this is the last time you will be looking at us. She needs your lipstick, please. A few of our friends, Minna and Hassan, were also coincidentally in Dubai with us, so we ended up spending a lot of time together. We even went skiing and meeting penguins in the last place on earth I would have thought would be possible. How is uh, um, Elizabeth is very appropriately dressed for this experience. So, <laughs> so I cannot press my legs. And this leg has fallen asleep 15 minutes ago. And Sheen almost made me eat a live lemon saying that that's how I'm supposed to eat the food. But otherwise, it's absolutely great. <laughs> The days quickly became a blur of tears of laughter, brilliant food, and beautiful places. Sheen tried to antagonize me by trying to make me wear something non-black and organize a meetup, only one of which worked while I antagonized her back by keeping her up chatting until 5 or 6 a.m. every night. This would explain our progression into delirious laughter by the end of the trip. I'm wearing one skirt here, one uh, dress Elizabeth here. takes the being covered in Dubai <laughs> way too strict. Like she thinks she has to wear two dresses. She stop. It's very cold in here. So I'm, so I'm properly covered up. Okay. Properly covered up. Mashallah. Yes. We celebrated this channel reaching 100,000 subscribers with a mind-blowingly good dinner at Selavi in Dubai, followed by our very own little tangled moment with boats and music by the river. Where are we going, Shane? We are going horse riding. In the desert. In the desert. I am so, so excited because I've never been horse riding before, but I definitely think I'm a horse riding kind of person. You are a <laughs> that phone. You are a <laughs> This all I heard. <laughs> we need to bleep this video out, Sheen, for the first time. <laughs> About the YOLO moment. You know what's funny? So, um, when, when Sheen was calling the horse riding guy. Yeah, I literally, look. I asked a very genuine question, very innocently. I said, what should we wear for the horse riding? <laughs> he said, clothes. 
I told she she gives off nudist vibes because this guy is like she's like please wear clothes when getting please on my horse. Clothes. He was like please wear clothes and shoes and I was like bro. There goes I, our naked I photo shoes. <laughs> so yeah, uh, we did as told. We are wearing clothes and shoes. <gasps> You're copying my hairstyle. Oh, I love it. We're twinning. Perfect. I just happened to look nicer. <sighs> Pick your friends wisely, guys. Pick your friends wisely. I got to take a huge item off my bucket list. I finally went horse riding, which was much more terrifying and fun than I thought because there were absolutely no safety measures. I got given no instructions and my horse was apparently brand new to getting trained. So by some miracle, I didn't fall in the end. The worst part actually was a parrot leaving its cage, which genuinely had me almost passed out from fear because I have a horrible phobia of birds. Sheen, how is your post-horse post riding walk? Oh, my legs. <laughs> oh, this is the best I can offer. <laughs> I found Dubai to be vibrant, fun, and quite indulgent. Incredible food, incredible views, beaches, and everything is so accessible. Although I will say I did start missing the grey London rain very soon. The only thing that went terribly for us was filming. My filming luck apparently crosses borders with me because we ended up having to film our videos about three times each because of the audio issues. She you explain what happened? We filmed four videos yep. and we recorded the audio connected yep. to my phone. Yep. And we've just realized that None of them are good. They just no, go. No, no, they're not. <laughs> I literally have no clue why this is happening. And it just happens at random times during the recording. So all our audio files are corrupted. I could transfer them. And I'm looking at these now. So the videos are fine. It's also four videos. Oh, my sad face. It's also four videos of fully recorded stuff. It's like a remix, a bad remix. All in all, I did have an absolutely incredible time. I loved collecting these clips and editing this video was so, so, so nostalgic. I had an incredible experience there and amazing memories created with Sheen, who despite making fun of 99% of the time, I absolutely loved to bits. Thank you so much and see you soon, Sheen. Bye.